Greetings, human life forms. I'm the Meister. Welcome back to the Wizard 101 Ice Walkthrough series. Today, um, I'm just gonna be continuing some questing in Triton Avenue. Um, on the side quest of things, I need a teleporter keystone so I can get and beat up the Kraken dude, which I believe. Yeah, Kraken. He's right down there. So I need to beat him up because I completely forgot what he was doing. You'd have to watch last episode to find out. And I do have a playlist for that. I'll also leave a little card over, I think it's over here on the corner over there. But anyways, on the main quest side of things, um, we haven't really done much with it. Um, as you can see, um, I was just helping clearing out the streets. So there's really nothing going on in the main quest of things. But, we do have some side quests that we have to get through first. So that is what- Oh my god, he looks creepy. Not really, but he looks cool. Alright. Ooh. This place looks nice. Too high ledge. Here are the rotting fodders. The Walking Dead. All right, 150. I'll just pass and hit next. <laughs> There's like a little laugh before he hits. Your casts a spell, I should say. <laughs> Scorpion. A snow serpent. Bedding. I got the teleporter keen stone. That easy. Oh no. I'm starting I'm getting used to using the double ASD keys. I used to always use the arrow keys. But recently I've like liked being like being able to move the camera like this <laughs> and and moving around at the same time instead of just stationary like that. I kinda like it, it's growing on me. Alright, so Homer, I have the keystone. You did it! Quickly, there's no time to lose. Yes. Now that their teleport is repaired, you can go deal with that Kraken. Head on down, and be careful. Good luck, wizard. Okay, I might need some health real quick. Are there... Yes, there's tons of wisps up here. And I only need one. When did I use my bottle? Oh, Golem Tower. That's right. The video that I... Got to record. Uh, hello, Kraken. Oh, God. Five hundred and ten. What do they think I can do? Huh? Wow, that's a lot of health. Oh, my God, that's a lot of health. I'm just going to stun him. Get a snow serpent that hopefully I can draw. Ouch. Oh. Oh. Okay, this is going to be a problem. So apparently these are useless. Um. I didn't draw a snow serpent. Um, I guess I'll just hit with one of my frost beetles. Hopefully he'll do enough. Well, either way, it's not gonna kill. Did that do the bare minimum? I think that did the bare minimum. All right, I'm gonna do some thunder. I'm just gonna start spamming. Yeah, fizzled. What a noob. Oh, okay, so they can resist now, okay. I don't know if I was taught that yet. Okay, so they can resist now. Diego might have taught me that already. I don't I don't think so. Night cracking. I'm actually doing pretty good in this guy. He has 186 left. Um I only used one Thunder Snake. So I should have another Thunder Snake in here. Um, 
I won't be needing that blizzard. And I will not be needing this frost beetle. I'm gonna pass. Oh boy. Mm. Oh, that's not good. That's not too good. Okay, oh, I need this to do like max damage. Hopefully, I can do max. Come on. Oh, oh no. Wait, if, if I fizzle here. Hold on. Oh no, actually, I think I'm good. Oh no, I might actually. Oh, guys. Oh no. Oh, I have this. I also have a 400. I'll do the 400. Oh, is he healing too? Can he heal? No, okay, he can't. At least I got a healer here. Hopefully I can get that snow serpent back. I cannot. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Wait, if he resists storm, that means he'll pro I'll probably boost on him. Blood bat. Right? He should. Let's see here. Yep, got the boost. 108. Nice. 78 health left. Come on, fire cat, I need you. I need you, fire cat. Oh, what's this? Oh, he already used that. Never mind. It's the same thing. For the win! You gotta be kidding me. Okay, um... Imp, please kill. Please, Imp. Imp, please. Imp, please. Please. Oh! Got him! Oh, I leveled up! Ooh. What do they think I am, a fire wizard? What's all this? Hello again. I need your assistance for a moment. Could you come see me, please? Lydia Grey Rose needs me. You heard about daily PvP rewards? All you need to do to earn free rewards is participate in PvP daily. <laughs> what? Okay, who are you? Oh, wonderful wizard. Our mutual oh. Master Ambrose would have words with you if you oh. despair. Get out of here. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. Okay, um, so I... Okay, can I get through? Thank you. Okay, so I have a lot of quests now. Okay, hold on. Thank you. Are you done with your problems? Okay, he's done with his problems. I'm gonna go see... Was it Headmaster? I think it was Headmaster. Oh, and this guy. Young wizard! Can't wait to tell you about my favorite pastime, fishing. Come find me by the water in the commons. Oh, okay, so there's... He's... The water is over there. I don't know where he is. Okay. Penny Dreadful. Oh, hello, Penny. Okay, um, I'm gonna do... Ah, uh, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna talk to the headmaster first, because I feel like that's the most important thing here. Oh, man, that's a lot of... Hmm. I'll do pet sounds. Wizard, I've heard you rescued an assortment of pets, you old chud. Do you still have the one you adopted? Yes. If so, do make sure to visit Milo Barker in the Pit Pavilion. Okay. He can walk you through everything you need to know about raising, training, and improving your pet. Interesting. Okay, hold on, Ambrose. I need I need to focus on this. I kind of know what um what's going on here. That's why I'm doing this quest because it I feel like it's the most important quest for my Wizard One One career. I have. Still not found any. I have. What? You've just collected a reagent. Oh, that's my first reagent. Used as ingredients in crafting recipes. 
You can find different reagents throughout the spiral, either by harvesting them, defeating monsters, or purchasing them. All right. Reagents go in your reagent bag, which you can access by selecting the crafting tab in your spell book, or by pressing J on your keyboard. Red J. Ooh. Reagents. A singular cattail. That's all I have. The Pet's Pavilion. Hmm. Hey, are you good, dude? Are you good? Well, what's going on over here? Hold on, hold on. What? 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 I, what? Are you just working on getting, like, your thighs nice and sweaty? I don't know. Just moving on. Let me. Hello. Why, hello there, my fine young friend. Have you by any chance participated in the dynamic display that is the Wizard City Pet Pavilion? No. It's a captivating cavalcade of prodigious proportions. I don't know what any of that means. Very spot of fine vendors of pets and pet provender. That splendid structure over there is the hatchery. Nice. The pet derby offers all manner of enticing entertainment and delightful distractions for wizard and pet alike. Nice. Okay. Um. Can I do uh, this stuff? Like, can I like? Oh, I can. I won't do that in this video. I won't do it in any video because that's probably s extremely boring for you people, so I'm just going to keep talking for now. Horde of the Rings. By the fantastic world of pets, young wizard, capital, but there's more to pets than snacks and games. They have special abilities. Yes, like my buddy, he gives me 2% power pip chance and he gives me some mana. Ooh. I buried metal rings in the common and the shopping district. What? If your pet can find them, good hunting. What? This quest requires you to have a pet and guide it to each goal. If you have a pet, equip it from the pet tab in your spellbook. All right. With a okay. pet equipped, you can control it directly. Click the pet button oh. on the bottom left of the screen. Then press the pet mode button. Okay. Right. You can play as your pet until its happiness runs out. Replenish happiness by feeding the pet snacks. Now use your pet to find those metal rings. Hold on, NFL. This is important. A Super Bowl preview for Buffalo with NFL Network schedule release airing D'Angelo Hall previews the Bills and matchup he can't wait to see. Probably the Buccaneers one. Okay, hold on. So, what are the places? We had shopping districts and the commons. Okay, let's start off from the commons here. All right, let me play as my pets and collect these dirt mounds. Oh, I can't. Okay, I'm over here. This is weird. Okay. Don't mind me. Just chilling. Okay. Alright, back here. Okay, we're going back here. Here's a dirt mound. Nice. Bush. Excuse me, Bush. Thank you, Bush. Okay, in the fairgrounds. Hello, Hilda. Got a dirt mound out here. Excuse me. Okay, thank you. Moving on. A tall top of the head. Okay. Alright, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. There's nothing to see here. God, that vulture can, like, kill me. Nothing to see here. Just a. Whatever I am. Here's another mound. I'm sure I can find these huge mounds with my wizard. 
Okay. Moving along. Moving along. Here's another mound. We have another mound. Okay. Shopping district. Okay. So I'm going to cancel play as pet. So I can save some of my happiness. Because I don't want him to be depressed. You know what I mean? Okay. So I have to do the shopping district. The professor. I don't remember you being there. Alright. Okay, play as pets. Oh boy. Play as pet. Okay, there we go. I don't know why my wizard just disappears. Wait, I don't think I don't think I've been out this way before. It's nice. Okay, we're going back here. <gasps> no way, is this Mist Wood? Hold on. Oh <gasps> I found it! The legendary Mist Wood. Hold on. Oh yeah. Now that's nice. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, look at that. I got my missed wood. I got my missed wood. I got my missed wood. Okay, I'm actually gonna... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I wanna talk to the lady. I found my... I'll do the pet thing in a minute. Oh, the missed wood. That, was a, that actually took me a few episodes to find. What's this? And a deep mushroom? Look at all this. Okay, this way. Look at all these reagents I'm getting. I'm a natural at collecting reagents. I'm amazing at collecting reagents. I should get a badge for it. Oh my god, why are there so many people with exclamation points all of a sudden? That missed one should do nicely. Nice. This tangle tree gets to work with hammer, plane, and saw. In a few moments, you have a nice little work table. Nice. Now, with a basic crafting table, you have a place to work. Nice! The Razor's Edge. Now, with your work table, you can begin to learn the fine trade of crafting, making your own items. All right. First, you should place the basic crafting table in your dorm room or castle. Your first assignment is to make two daggers of absolution. You should have no difficulty. All right. You'll need to buy a recipe from me and then gather the required ingredients. When you've got all your ingredients, use your basic crafting table to make the affaires. All right. When you have made two, two daggers of absolution, two. bring them back to me and I'll award you a novice crafter badge. Oh. So remember to bring them here when you're finished. It's a lot of gold. Good luck. I can't wait to see them. I can't wait to see it either. I'll put the crafting table in at the end of the video. So I need a dagger of absolution. Here it is. Oh, <laughs> I already have a dagger. Can I just buy a dagger? Does that work like that? Okay, so what do I need here? I need four sapphire, eight black coal, and then I need to find some more of those stuff. Okay. Ooh, would you look at that? Do you like how that, like how life works out like that? Okay, so I need eight of this. Okay, and then I need four of the blue ones, which is this. Okay, and then I just need to find two cattail and four mist wood. And I'm done. Nice and easy. No, 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 no. She thinks I can make a dagger, two daggers, in two minutes. Not even two minutes, like 30 seconds. Have you made the two daggers? I got to help you. Okay, am I going this way? Okay, I'm going this way. This is the way I am traveling today. Alrighty. It's always exciting times and you start off with a new wizard you get all these new things to do okay i'm going am i a joke to you are you kidding me hey, that guy i feel like should have a beard i don't know okay moving in inward we're going in and we have it there is another dirt mound 
I'm assuming it's back here. No, it's... Oh my god, okay. This area is very hard to maneuver through. Am I going back? Yeah, I'm going back here. Here's the mound. There we go. We got them all. Nice. Okay, back to the barking men. Oh my god. Um, get me out of here. I'm claustrophobic. Okay. Alright, let me wrap up this quest real quick here. There wasn't too many battles today. That's cool though. We got a few. We got that crack in that. Was, that was a tough one. I almost died. That was that was pretty bad. Okay, I'm done. Ah, your pack found them all. Well done indeed. You never know what you might find if you keep your eyes open and your pet eyes too. Nice. Okay, I will do that later. Um, I'm going to. Okay, I'm kind of jumping all over the place, but it's okay. It's fine. Trust me. It's okay. Um. I wanted to do two things real quick. I wanted to talk to this guy about fishing. You'll I'll tell you guys why in a minute, but Hello. Nope, and nobody cares. No? Oh, well, let me tell you. Fishing is a terrific hobby. And you won't is it? find a more relaxing pastime, eh? Huh? Alright. If you like, I can teach you how to cast for fish. Magically, of course. Then you can catch your own wapas. Nice. First off, you gotta be in an area of the spiral populated with fish. Okay. You'll know you are when the fishing icon appears. Alright. Clicking the fishing icon button displays your fishing spells. Fishing is a magical activity in the spiral, you know. Alright. Your fishing spells consist of fish catching spells and fishing utility spells. All right. Click on a fish catching spell to cast a magical lure. You want it to land in front of a fish so they notice it. All right. If you don't like where your lure lands, click the cancel spell button to quickly recast the spell. All right. When the magical lure flashes, that means a fish has noticed it and is coming closer to take a nibble. Take a nibble. As it nibbles, the lure will rise and fall a bit. The trick is to wait until the lure completely sinks below the water. Okay, I'm not reading any of that. Then you reel him in. Timing is crucial, so be sure to hit the space bar quickly to invoke the fish catching spell properly. Okay. So are your spells. Every fish has a magical school type, and fish are more attracted to lures from their same school. All right. When you use a lure correctly, your magic will snare the fish and float it back to you, all right? All right. You'll see the name and size of every fish you catch. Small fries are the tiniest ones, but whoppers are the biggest. <laughs> start in your fish basket. The angler's tome has a record of all the fish you ever caught. Click on it to open it. Yeah, right. The angler's tome will tell you how many of each type you've caught, along with the smallest and largest sizes. Yeah, right. Another important tip to know is that every fish you come across responds only to your presence, no matter what. All right. So don't worry about competition, or that other wizards will scare away the fish. <laughs> You're the only one who can do that. Yeah, right. Now that I've explained the basics of our magical fishing, let me give you the lesser frost lure. It's a good basic lure spell. All right. Go to the water behind old Zeke over there and use the lesser frost lure to catch a frost decoy and an ice cooter. Okay. Okay. We got a plan here. We got some stuff going on. I like it. All right. There's one last thing I wanted to do. That's Diego the Duel Master with daily PvP, which I need to look at real quick. You're not the one who does that, right? Wait. You wait. No. Do you? Do you not? I don't know. I get free stun block because I'm a nice wizard. I'll take it. Oh, gladly take it. Okay, so there was a thing about daily PvP that was over here. Win one ranked player versus player match. Huh. Okay, um. I want to go. Okay. So here's my thinking for everything so far. Um, stuff like um, taking care of my pet in the pet pavilion, um, fishing, and doing daily PvP. I will all do that off camera because 
I gotta, like, I don't think watching you guys take care of my pet for 20 to 30 minutes is gonna be entertaining. Neither is fishing for 25 to 30 minutes. <laughs> and, um, PvP, I mean, I don't know, I mean, I'll, after I finish, like, all the story and stuff, I'll, the mic, uh, um, I'll, I'll probably make videos of PvP, but probably not. Well, I'll, I'll make a day, I'll make daily videos. Not daily videos, but I'll make a video of each match I do. And I'll kind of make it like a separate series. Yeah, that just, I, that just came out of my head at this, this moment. So, anyways, I'll get, I, 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 this is a disaster. Let me just, I got a long blue runner. I don't remember getting this. We always need to decorate at the end of the day. Okay, can I place this? I'd like to place this. No, the only place I could play it is like 50 feet out. Really? It was like a step. No, I just can't. Okay. I'll place it right here. I don't know. That's a good spot, I guess. Shaggy Tucker, I will not need you. You could just hide in the corner over here. <laughs> there you are. Okay, and then the basic crafting table. I can get placed right here. At the end of each video, I'm gonna do that. So yeah, we have this. So yeah, we just need four mist wood and two cattail. So yeah, I think that's gonna wrap it up for this episode. Again, oh hello, how are you doing? You doing good? Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'll, every time I do PvP, I won't add it to the walkthrough series because that will just take way too much time, and it'll take me years to get to the walkthrough. So I'll have it like be its like own separate thing. But I will do it every day. But I'll just have a bunch of videos backed up for it. You know what I mean? So that's he's barking. I guess I'll end this while he's barking. So next episode, um, I still have a bunch of things to do. I still have to talk to Arthur about cleaning the streets of Triton Avenue. There is like a bunch of things. I still need to collect the tomes. I gotta make my outfit. And I need to meet this guy in Marleybone. I need to make daggers. I need to catch some fish. I need to talk to other people. A lot of stuff is going on. We are just nearly scratching the surface. I'm sorry my dog's barking, if you can hear it. I don't know, I can hear it, So, which means you probably can. But, I have a Twitch. I'll leave that in the description. Um, I, once I reach level 100 in my Fire Wizard, I will be live-streaming Darkmoor on there. Mm. He's, like, literally right above my head, too, barking. Um, I have a Twitter that I'll leave in the description below as well. I mainly use for NFL content, but it's there if you want to follow me over there. And I also have an Instagram, which I don't use too much, but you can follow me there anyways if you want to. And I don't really have much else to say except life forms out.